All right, so we are interested in the rice paddy fields of China. By the way, China produces 30% of all of the world's rice. So we want to know if adding fish to the flooded rice paddies reduces the proportion of fertilizer needed. We look at 115 fields, we place fish into 55 of them, and leave the other 60 as they are. We find that the fields that included fish reduce their need for fertilizer by 30%. What we want to do is we want to identify the following. We want to identify the population, the sample, the treatment slash control slash placebo group, the treatment slash response variable, the parameter, and the statistic. So first, the population. What the population is, is that's the bigger picture that we're interested in. So if we reread the question, we're interested in the rice paddy fields of China. So we're not interested in all of the fields of rice anywhere. We're just interested in the ones in China. So the population would be rice paddy fields of China. Now, the sample, that's the thing that we actually looked at. So did we look at every rice paddy field in China? No way, China's huge. There's way more than 115. So the sample was the 115 fields that we looked at. Now, notice that when we did our treatment and control group, we split them up. So we have a group of 55 and a group of 60. So that's our sample. And then we took our sample and split up into two groups. So the treatment group are the fields that got fish. And the control group would be the fields that didn't get fish. So the treatment group, that's always the group that we change or do something to. And that's usually the thing that we're interested in seeing if there's a change or not. The control group is the one that we leave alone. What that does is it gives us a baseline for measuring our treatment against. So if I just put fish in fields and record how much fertilizer I used, that wouldn't really tell me a whole lot unless I know how much fertilizer I'd use without the fish. Now the treatment and the response variable. So what are we doing and then what are we looking at? So we're adding fish. Okay, so the addition of fish or no fish is the treatment. Now what we want to see, the response, is the amount of fertilizer. So response is amount of fertilizer used. Okay, now the parameter, that's the measurement of the population that we're interested in. So in this case, we're looking at percentage of fertilizer used. Now the statistic is, okay, so when you took that measurement percentage and you applied it to your sample, what did you actually see? So the statistic in our case is a reduction of fertilizer by 30%. Now, just to keep going with this, let's say that we wanted to look at our variables and we wanted to decide if they're categorical or numerical. So the fish, are those categorical or numerical? Well, in this case, since we're putting them into bins, you either have fish or you don't, this would be categorical. Remember, another word for this would be qualitative, since we're talking about equality. Now, the percentage of fertilizer, since this is a percentage, it's something that we can scale by, it's something that we can put a number to, that would be a numerical variable. Or remember, this is also called quantitative.